What will it take to get your CCNA by May? Let's find out. Here are some of the things you'll need. A CBT Nuggets subscription plan. You know that was coming. But hey, this is a CBT Nuggets video. Two, a study plan. Three, home lab or virtual lab setup. Four, practice exams. And five, lots of study. What you'll want to do is work backwards to move forwards. So we're jumping to the end and you're going to pick your exam date. Yes, go choose the date right now. After you've picked your date, schedule your exam. Now that you know the date of your exam, you'll know how much you need to study every day. Typically, if you only study for 30 minutes per day, you should be ready for the CCNA in 26 weeks. Our advice? Find a consistent time to train and stick to the schedule. We know it's not the easiest thing to do, but in the end, it will pay off. Create your home lab. This will be a great tool for preparing for the exam because hands-on experience is essential for all Cisco exams. Home labs used to be almost mandatory for the CCNA, but advances in simulators and emulators have rendered physical home labs largely obsolete. Call us nostalgic, but there's nothing like building a rack to call your own. We recommend three routers, three switches, and two laptops. You can also use a virtual lab. Check the link below for picking the right network simulators or emulators for the CCNA. You've been studying and now you're ready to take a practice exam. And one of the great things about your CBT Nugget subscription is that it includes practice exams. With practice exams, the general rule is if you can score 90%, you should be ready for the real thing. Remember, the CCNA is 100 to 120 questions and you're given 120 minutes to complete. That gives you about 60 seconds per question to answer it. Finally, exam day is here. First, I know this sounds easy, but try to get a good night's sleep. Take your time, not too much time. Sometimes reading the answers to the questions first will help you determine what the correct answer is when you read the question. Check your watch. Time will go by quickly, so be mindful of how long it's taking to answer the questions. Be careful about pressing the next button on a question twice. It may jump a question over and you can't go backwards. You got this. So relax and enjoy your adventure in IT.